Hey y'all, welcome back to Lightworks. I hope that you are blessed and well. If you are new here, welcome to the channel. Thank you so much for clicking on the video. I hope that you are getting what you need thus far from the channel. Please feel free to check the video library. There are tons of videos there that the divine may uh, give you a little energetic nudge about when you see them something that's in all of these videos for you there's always a healing message or tip in all of these videos and so thank you for being here please hit the like button subscribe join the family i would love to have you if you are returning hey so family what's going on i love you guys so very much i pray for all of you that you are all doing well that you are navigating through this life okay this life is just what it is difficult sometimes beautiful sometimes but overall the divine is always with us working with us and for us and uh, coming against any opposition so just know that and that in itself should be enough to make you smile okay so y'all there's so many downloads that have been coming um I was just sitting here meditating and connecting with this clear quartz crystal and there's someone that is feeling like they're losing their mind okay this could be you or this could be someone that's watching you or connected to you in some way this song kept coming into my mind just this one part of the song it says my 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 I'm about to lose my mind okay that's a yellow song I love yellow um and don't pay attention to the voice just the words okay so somebody is losing their mind somebody is seeing clearly the truth of something some type of situation this is a clear course so somebody seeing clearly somebody also is being guided to get a clear course crystal to clear your energy um also one two two i've been seeing one two two for the last week okay when i picked up my phone a minute ago it said ten twenty two so I um, looked up the angel number 122 and there's several different meanings that the guides want me to share with you all. It says 122, it's a sign that you're making progress on your spiritual journey and you are capable of using the positive energy around you to achieve your spiritual goals, okay? Another one says Love takes off masks that we fear we cannot live without and know we cannot live within. Okay? Clarity. Clarity. Okay? Another one says, Angel number 122 is symbolic that of the angels encouraging you to maintain focus on your hopes and desires. Another one says, angel number 122 makes your life fulfilling and cherishable with its divine presence. You will notice that the appearance of the number in your life will fill your life with happiness and abundance. Self-belief and hard work are, only, are the only two keys to success. Have faith in the universe, okay? That being said, okay, I feel like you may be getting clarity on who you are. You may be feeling clear about or aware of your purpose and what you're meant to be doing. You, your clarity, your decisiveness, your desire to press forward towards your spiritual goals is making somebody lose their mind, okay? Somebody's losing their mind. I'm also hearing that somebody could be projecting onto you to make you feel like you're losing your mind so that you cannot clearly see what the objective is, what the divine has for you, and what you're meant to be doing, okay? Holy Spirit, 
divine angels, divine ancestors, most high God, archangels, guardian angels, and divine ancestors, all of the highest white light. We love you. We thank you for being with us. Archangel Michael, please protect our energy. Please close the door on anything that is not of the highest white light. Let's go ahead and take a few long deep breaths, y'all. Inhale positive life force energy. Exhale and release any stress or anxiety. Somebody's wheels are spinning. Somebody's losing it. Let's take a few long deep breaths. This is going to be a general energy reading, so it may not apply to everyone. Take only what resonates with you. Don't try to make anything fit, okay? My disclaimer, I'm not a mental health professional, not a doctor, a lawyer, or a financial advisor. So if anything comes up related to any of those areas, please do seek professional assistance in those areas, okay? Someone here is being guided to continuously do these breathing exercises daily. Because your guides are and angels are sending you messages, helping to guide you on your ascension path, on your spiritual goals. And I feel like you're getting a lot of it, but they want you to keep your energy clear, okay? They're guiding me to this book, okay? This is giving me sun energy, enlightenment, enlightened, authentic self. This yellow is screaming, okay? So there's some type of illumination. Um, I feel like this is an adverse illumination, meaning this person who's losing their mind is overwhelmed by this brightness. They're overwhelmed by what they're seeing, what's being illuminated. Okay, my spirit guides are so interesting. I'm thinking of they're going to guide me to something inside the book, which is how it usually is. But they're saying no, everything that they want me to decode a message here. Um, the, the most prevalent message here is this sun energy. And there even looks like a sun here. Okay. <clears throat> Self-awareness. Okay. And if you see in this little circle, tiny here, it says self there. Okay, so with that in this middle of the sun, there's some self-awareness that the divine is, has brought to someone here about yourself. Okay, I feel like this is this energetic energy um, that we read about in one of the angel number descriptions for one, two, two. Okay, guide. Okay, this is your, your guides showing you who you are your guides okay showing you who you are somebody is gaining full consciousness and awareness of what your purpose is what you're meant to be okay somebody does not like your authenticity somebody does not like that you are original that you do your thing okay that you stay to yourself that you're not all uh, you don't have to have an entourage of people you're okay with sitting. We got sat. This is this, the author's name, Sat. Okay, you're okay with sitting by yourself, okay? <clears throat> okay, they're showing me tick here. So there's something significant about time. Tick top energy. Okay, tick. Time to complete something. Somebody is running out of time. <laughs> 
This is giving me den, D-E-N, lion's den energy. Somebody is losing their mind. Do you hear me? Somebody feels like they're in the lion's den, like Daniel. But this person is not of the light. This person is not of the light, okay? They're not operating out of this energy. They are aware that they are in danger. This person, okay, we have F-L-E-S here. This is giving me flesh, okay? This is a person that operates out of flesh, ego, pride, that type of energy. This person is in their own, okay, the lions. They're showing me the lions. This is all internal. This is all mental. This person, this is swords energy, okay? This is a, like cackling hen hand type of energy someone that sits around and talks about other people okay and they don't pay attention to themselves and what they're needing to do this person is very fake they're not natural like you anything else here holy spirit okay they're showing me sight here there's an S here, sight. They're showing me something about your sight, foresight, okay? Insight. Thank you, Holy Spirit. There's some insight. There's more insight that is going to come out here, okay? Yeah. Yeah. This is an unexpected outcome. This person is losing their mind. This person could be telling people about this cackling hand energy. Could be having conversations about you with other people. About what's going on with you. Ego. What did I say? This person is... <clears throat> very egotistical this person is very selfish we saw self on that book okay what's the message holy spirit this person has an understanding i'm trying to tell you this says i see your side of the story i see I started with this clear crystal. Somebody is seeing. Somebody understands. And whatever they understand about you is driving them crazy. This has been revealed. This person could be, I'm hearing, take me to church. I'll worship like a dog. This person is losing it. They're like, God, what have I done? What did I do? What can I do? What am I seeing? What's going on? Okay? This person could have been dishonest about and something about something concerning you. Lying. Regret. Am I taking this? No. trying to tell you this person is losing it doing some reflection right now thinking about what they've done seven of pentacles energy they could be at church asking god to forgive you see how this looks like a church on this card asking god for forgiveness for what they've done What have they done, Holy Spirit? Time. I said time was significant. Tick on the book. Okay? To complete something. This is relevant. Value. 
time is money I'm hearing time is money see this money here what is it Holy Spirit guilty Ooh, what did this person do guilty is significant damage okay what did this person do Holy Spirit what's guilty Okay, they want me to switch decks. Oh my goodness. As I was grabbing a what's the T decks uh, deck, this card flipped over in a completely different deck. Let go of guilt. I'm clarifying guilty right now. This card says when you allow your light, this yellow, okay? When you allow your light to shine brightly, you inspire others, okay? Forgive yourself for what you think you've done or not done. And trust that God loves you unconditionally for who you are. Learn and grow from past mistakes instead of berating yourself for them, okay? This person is being guided to go within. This is God extending an olive branch to this person. Whatever they have done, I feel like they have, hmm, okay. There's more than one person here. I'm, I just got that. There's more than one person that's done something here that's getting clarity about who you are. So somebody here that's feeling guilty and losing it God is saying, let go of the guilt, okay? Forgive yourself. Connect with God. Ask for forgiveness, okay? Start healing yourself. Start working on yourself, okay? That's for somebody. Somebody else has done way too much, okay? I, they just got me to open this book up to a random page and bound is here when i tell you this other person they've done way 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 too much how can i be free from my experience do you hear the holy spirit speaking this person is losing their mind because they're trying to be free okay whatever they did this other person i'm trying to tell you my mind this person lost it person is losing it. This person did a lot to start drama in your life. Playing the role I'm hearing. Played a major role. Did some type of dark deeds, dirty offers. This person, whoever this is, I'm hearing it was a no-no. It was a no-no. This person, this person is close. Unexpected outcome. This is somebody that you would have never expected to do whatever they did. I'm here never. This could be a parent. This could be a sibling. This could be someone very close to you, a spouse. Um... This dirty offer keeps coming up. This gives me somebody that's holding on. This they're going into a dark place and trying to hold on, but they did they made a deal with the devil. This is this card's energy. The drama started right behind it. That's a confirmation. Okay, so this is what this guilty is. Some type of dirty offer. They had something to gain. The value card. The money that we saw. Time is money. Time is money. What did they offer? What did they offer, Holy Spirit? What did they offer concerning the collective? Looking you up. They offered you sacrifice. 
sacrifice you. What is the dirty offering guilty, Holy Spirit? Yeah, photo proof. Wants you, okay? It's you. The dirty offer was you. To whom, Holy Spirit? This person is a wolf in sheep's clothing. Never would have expected this person to do this to you. This person offered you something about you. This person offered you because you are the jackpot. What else, Holy Spirit? Yeah, too busy winning. Okay, this is what they saw. This is what they felt like they could gain from. You are winning. One, two, two. Spiritual goals, abundance. The angels are encouraging and guiding you. You're connected. You're tapped in. Okay, you are the jackpot. So someone super close to you, okay, that is wearing a mask, wolf in sheep's clothing, is pressed for time. I feel like they got an understanding of who you were. Something was revealed to this person. Bright sun on the book, illumination, okay? They then revealed who you were to somebody that looked like this, a business person. That's all about time and money and action, okay? action the last word on this card okay so they took this offer or offered you up your energy now they're feeling guilty they've been giving you fake smiles fake love okay now this dirty offer this is the devil energy here this time card these two right here this is devil energy the devil is like it's time to pay up. Where is what you promised me? This person is re feeling bad now. My mind, I'm losing my mind. This person is trying to hold on from dear life. They don't want to go into this darkness. Okay, but it's too late. What does it say here? I'm afraid it's too late. Okay? Mm, 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 mm. Ooh, this person. Now, look what's here. The forcer. The devil is forcing this person to produce. And guess what? This little light over here uh, uh, called you. One, two, two, four, four, four. Protected by the divine. They never going to produce you. Now this person is crying. I'm about to lose my mind. Feeling guilty reflecting on what they have done asking God for forgiveness at the church at the altar on their knees praying for forgiveness because they didn't mess up Ooh. this person mm, mm, mm. what in the world they are on the hook okay Hangman energy. This person that messed up. Royally. Royally. They're telling me something's here in this deck. This is a combination deck of angel messages and an angel answers. Something's here. Holy Spirit, what's the message? Okay, they said to pull it. Let me see. It says, live your, this was in the reverse. It says, live your life with both feet in, commit fully to being here. In the reverse, y'all. Oh, my goodness. This is this devil energy. This is what's happening to this person and why they're losing their mind. Live your life with both feet in. Commit fully. 
okay? This person is not committed fully. This person is holding on for dear life because they are afraid of what they have done. The devil is telling this person to commit to this dark deed. That's why this is in the reverse. Mm, 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 mm. So you got one person here that God is urging to let go of. And I feel like this could be the divine too. This could be the divine telling this person, you've already committed to this dark deed. You've already sold your soul. I don't know what to tell you. Okay. Wow. But there's one person here that's also done something that they feel guilty about but the effects of what they've done although the divine is telling this person to ask for forgiveness make things right clear your energy be a better person do what you need to do okay this person i also feel like the divine is letting them sit in their own mess in their mind because both of these people are losing their mind Walking away into the light in the reverse. That's this person. This person is not walking away into the light. They're going to the dark. Oh my. Oh my. The other person. God is urging this person to make the changes now. Confirmation. Okay, y'all. Let's get some more insight and see what's going on here. I heard all money ain't good money. Okay, so this somebody could have told this person don't do this or but this person wasn't in this energy this person saw those dollar signs and they got ready they were like oh yeah oh yeah I'm doing this okay but God <laughs> that's a confirmation okay but God it's like, oh, no, 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 not this one. Absolutely not. What are you doing? You need to use your intuition. What are you thinking about? Okay. Yeah, this person was thinking about a windfall of abundance. But an abundance of what? Okay. Of darkness. An abundance of anxiety unable to escape this matrix this person set themselves up real bad let's see what else the divine wants us to know look at this it fell out alone now it's, it's in the reverse they cannot escape the matrix this says escaping the matrix it's in the reverse now this devil energy. Two of cups. This could have been somebody you were in a relationship with. A partnership. This again could have been family. I feel family strong. This could be a spouse. This could be parent, cousin, auntie, brother, sister. Thank you, Holy Spirit. They're guiding me to put this here. They're saying family on this. So some family has done something that God, okay, okay. So both of them are family. The person that God is giving a pass to and the person that God is not giving a pass to. Both of these are family. Wow. cut cords and losses so Holy Spirit this person that you're guiding to let go of the guilt 
are they going to be permitted back into the collective's life or are you guiding them to cut cords with this person okay we have half faith so this is somebody that the divine is going to ask you to forgive okay i do feel like you need to set boundaries whatever this is this yellow here all of this yellow this is going to be illuminated to you it's going to be revealed to you what this person did who this person is it's coming out there's, there's sun everywhere okay you're going to have a clear understanding a clear understanding of who did what why they did it and you're going to know how to handle the situation this is what the divine is saying okay there's something significant about a man october you could be born in october this person could be born in october halloween okay this is giving me sacrificial energy. One, one, one. Holy Spirit, what's dirty offer? Yeah. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. This dirty offer is presenting the cold hard truth and this anxiety. This person now sees the truth of what this offer is bringing into their world and it's driving this person mad oof 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 this person feels really bad I feel like they feel bad because look do it today stop putting it off in the reverse this person doesn't want the devil is on this person's behind they're not doing it because they have no sacrifice to give they're not going to be able to give this anointed one up it ain't going to happen so now this person this person doesn't want to do this to anybody because i feel like this anxiety and this What's been setting in is, wow, this is really causing a lot of anxiety for this person. They've got to produce. Remember, this is time. The devil is on this person's butt. Ooh, this energy is getting nasty. Mm -mm. Archangel Michael, please come in and clear the energy, clear this space. The wrath. Okay, I'm feeling like this person is terrified and they're losing it. They're seeing things. They're hearing things. They're, they're terrified. And they don't know what to do. I feel like this is a means of how this person has been making money. They've been doing this to people and they've been successful and they haven't, it's an unexpected situation. This is somebody you would look at and never guess that this is what they've been doing behind the scenes. Again, this is somebody close to you that doesn't look like that on the outside. We saw a wolf in sheep's clothing. This is somebody that sacrifices souls, okay, in some capacity. We're going to get into it. Archangel Michael, please clear the energy in the space here. Anything being sent here, anything in a negative vibration, please return it. I'll shut it. This person, y'all, look what's on the bottom of the deck. We saw the Forcer card in this other deck. The devil is... Whoa. The devil is forcing this person to put both feet in and commit to doing what they said they were going to do. They're saying do it today. 
stop putting it off. Oh boy. Well, this person is sad and blue about their bad decisions. Holy Spirit was guilty. Lies, lies, and more lies. The lies, they feel guilty because they lied and promised you that they could do this. Okay? We have do not look back in the reverse. This person can't stop looking back. This is this guilty energy. This person is thinking about you heavily losing their mind. I feel like throughout this process, this person has discovered, yeah, the truth, the true truth about how anointed and protected you are. Okay. This person, yep, look at this, is looking closer. This says, do not look back in the reverse. This person is looking closely on how did I miss this? How did I do this? Why did I do this? Why didn't I use my intuition? What else should we be aware of? Breathe. Probably this person could be having trouble breathing. Also, loved one, divine one, anointed one, you are being guided to breathe. There was something significant about the way we were breathing when this read started to relax yourself because you could be in your head. Something that this person is sending could have been some type of uh, projection. This person may be wanting to call you with phone but not getting an answer or is being blocked by the divine. What else should we be aware of? <clears throat> remain calm, okay? So breathe and remain calm. This is for you, divine one. They don't want you to be worried about any of this. They want you to continue, as fo continue to focus on your spiritual path. One, two, two. Okay, you might be guided to look that number up for yourself because there's tons of different meanings and you may find one that really resonates with you. So look that angel number up when you have time. This person is praying for a change. They want to get out of this. They want to take a different path. They want to get on the road less traveled, but they can't. <clears throat> this person, this card says making nice comments, but really hates you. This person really loves you. Now they realize how much they love you, who you are, what you represent. They feel very guilty for what they've done to you. But they can't make any comments. They can't say anything. They can't speak. Okay? You're being guided to cleanse your energy. I'm seeing this person trying to cleanse their energy to get the devil off of them. But this is not working for them. But you are being guided to cleanse your energy. I'm trying to tell you. This person got the devil on them. The ancestors on them. The angels on them. God is on them. And this person is just, they realize they're not going to be able to win. This says wants to win at all costs. They're realizing that they don't even want to win. They just want to get out of this. What else, Holy Spirit? August. The number eight. Somebody could be born in August. This could be a Leo. 
This could also be about abundance. Eight represents abundance. Also, it is the infinity sign. What goes around comes around. This is the year of the dragon. This is the year of karma. Okay, eight. Infinite possibilities, also karma. Okay. This is falling on too busy winning and jackpot, okay? I feel like there is a lot of abundance coming in for someone. We read that in the 122 angel message. Also, I feel for this person, this person, the jackpot that they thought they hit is going to be the karma for whatever they put out, okay? Decisions, decisions. They made theirs, okay? Now they have to deal with it. This person can't believe what they're going through. They're losing it. I'm trying to tell you. This dishonest, deceitful energy has solidified their faith. Now, the devil, look, this person is wanting to go back. I want you back, okay? They can't come back to you. The devil is forcing this person to commit to what they've done. These spiritual attacks that they were sending... The devil is making them stay in that energy. <sighs> Angels are helping you. Okay? Know this. What's the outcome here, Holy Spirit? Ooh, this fell on top of cold hard truth. And... Ooh. Take yourself and your guides out today. I feel like this is a dark message. This came out in reverse. This person is thinking about taking themselves out. This card says, take yourself and your guides out today. But I'm trying to tell you, this energy was my mind. Losing my mind. This person is contemplating taking themselves out. I do not promote or uh, condone any energies like that. If you are here and this is you and you are seeing and hearing this message, please do seek professional assistance before you do something like this, okay? There is help for you, professional help. Please seek a mental health professional. Very important, okay? King. This is this devil energy peeking out right here. If you could see how this looks, this person is on this energy's heels lurking. Do it today. Do it today. They want to they want this person to produce a body. Look at this. Head, shoulders, knees, and toes. Okay? Man. at this all these cards just flew into this two of cups this connection is over with this person they've destroyed it okay your angels and ancestors have stepped in okay they have seen these unspoken words and text messages conversations whatever this person was doing your angels and ancestors were watching this person okay they've advise this person to pause to stop doing what they were doing this person didn't stop let's see what this is y'all okay this is july august okay this is progressing okay july august out and i said october was significant so something between july and october was going on where your ancestors were connecting with this person July. This is also Leo energy. Okay. I feel like July, 4th of July 
energy explosive okay um, fireworks explosive tower energy bombs okay I feel like this person got a lot of signs at the beginning of whatever this was back in July now they could have done some type of ritual on Halloween but all this time two or three times July August October your ancestors and guides advise this person against this and now you see what just happened how this got knocked down with all of this coming out this person can barely stand this person is losing it. <laughs> this person is losing it. Okay? And all of this is knocking this person down. Because your ancestors warned this person. They showed this person something to make them understand. Look. Reveal and understand it. You better stop what you're doing. You better pause. They're saying there's one more here before I get to this other day. Yeah, they told this. Thank you, Holy Spirit. They told this person to stop before they got into this dark energy. They said, you have the power to transform. You have the power to evolve, to change, to stop doing what you're doing, to think about this, to pause, okay? They warned this person. This is your family. This is somebody you love. They told this person and ancestors that could love this person too. Some of y'all passed on loved ones could have told this person, don't do that. Stop. This is not going to end well for you. This person didn't listen. You hear that movement out, of here, out, out there right now? This person is getting shaken up. This person is losing it. Okay? Losing it. Trap themselves. Okay, this is the last time okay this person may have tried to convince or to energetically convey to your ancestors or spirit guides this is the last time they were gonna do something I said this person had been doing this okay but I feel like whatever they were bringing to the devil the devil wasn't satisfied so you come along, the anointed one, with all this light, okay? And I feel like, Holy Spirit, did this person even struggle? Oh my goodness. I was asking, did this person struggle with the thought of giving you up? This person was thinking about the gain, the money, the abundance. And you see the right card and the fake card? I don't know if y'all caught that. The curse card, the justice card. This person, there's right sticking out right there. They was thinking about sacrificing you for, for what they could gain. Remain calm, loved one. person has is having massive headaches because they can't stop thinking and my head is getting tight let me grab some water yes I'm trying to 
gonna tell you the ancestors pleaded with this person don't do this stop this person was stubborn they didn't stop oh my goodness this is not gonna be long okay this person they're showing me a, a funeral service right now that's what they're showing me with this card with this church and stop and unfortunately I pray that this person gets the help that they need because they're losing their mind and we had take yourself out today by here and in the upright this is about taking yourself and your guides out today this is meaning energetically going out for a day with your guides your spirit guides your angels your ancestors going out to lunch and bringing the energy of their spirit with you okay in the reverse this says take yourself out today okay and uh, there's some strong energy there and i pray that this person if you're watching that they don't do this and that they get the help that they need Okay, but I'm feeling it strong because whatever they've done, mm -mm, they 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 messed up when they tried to offer you up, and they did not listen when the ancestors and angels nudged them and told them to stop. What else should we be aware of concerning this message, Holy Spirit? I'm trying to tell you. The magnitude, the number of times they were warned. They were trying to teach this person, trying to show this person, trying to guide this person. They did not listen. Stubborn, still on the bottom of the deck. What else, Holy Spirit? Your guys were like, okay. Okay. What else can we do? You're drinking the Kool-Aid. You're working with that poison. You're dealing with the devil. This it this is sad, y'all. This energy is really sad. person had listened they were listening to the devil <sighs> my goodness this person is trying to escape what they are feeling right now what's going on in their mind <sighs> oh my goodness this person messed themselves up I'm trying to tell you this person messed themselves up What else, Holy Spirit? I'm ready to get out of this energy. Oh my God, it makes me want to cry. <sighs> this person did this to their own family. Somebody that was loyal to them. Somebody that loved them. This person... lost it y'all I'm trying to tell you this person is gone they're fighting with themselves in their mind they're seeing things they're hearing things they are losing their natural mind and the ancestors are all over them whatever they, they had to do it they were forced to keep going the devil was not about to let this person stop so they had to keep sending you whatever they were sending you 
and the ancestors had to keep blocking it and putting the beat down on this person. And this is what you offered this person. And look what's right behind it. This person promised you to the devil. I'm so sorry, y'all. The energy, this is this person's energy I'm picking up on. All they can do is cry. They've lost their mind. They've literally lost their mind. It's gone. I don't know what's going to happen. to. Well, I do know what's going to happen to this person, but this makes me so sad. I do not believe this person. My goodness. <clears throat> Holy Spirit, what else do we need to know? People need to stop playing with the devil. I'm trying to tell you. This person was in a union that was always going to hurt them. This Union, this vow they had with the devil was never going to pan out for them. This was always going to be a mistake, an accident, always going to hurt them, destroy them. People need to get a clue and stop playing and let the devil bribe you. This is hurting because this is somebody's close family member. This is somebody so close. And I'm also picking up your energy because when it's happened and this is revealed to you, it's going to break your heart. <laughs> not only is it going to hurt you, this person's not going to make it. I'm not trying to prophesy it, but it's already here. It's going to hurt you because this person is gone. <laughs> and it's going to hurt you because you're going to see all that this person was doing to you when you loved them. <laughs> Let me get some Kleenex, y'all. This is, I'm ready to close this out. <laughs> Holy Spirit, what else do we need to know? Yeah, this is the robbery car falling right on top of marriage and accident, okay? And this time card that we saw represented by the devil, the devil was always going to take this person. This person had no chance. This person thought that the, the devil told this person, made this person feel like they were going to be blessed with all that money or whatever they were promised. The ancestors tried to tell this person, no, it ain't going to work that way. That's not how this is going to work. 
The devil is not your friend. The devil's never going to do nothing for you but destroy you. Final messages, please, Holy Spirit. Look at this. This person took that vow. That put them in this conflict, this mental imprisonment that they are in. That I don't know. I mean, I feel like they're I feel like they're going to come out of this overload energy, but not the way that they want to come out of it. Oh my goodness. Let me clear this energy again, y'all. This is heavy. Archangel Michael, please clear the energy in the space here. Please clear the energy for the collective. Oh, Archangel Raphael, please be with my loved ones. Please be with the collective at this time. Help them to heal through whatever this is that they are enduring or will endure, Holy Spirit. You're going to be okay. I want to clear this energy and focus on you, loved one. I cannot close this read like this. It's too heavy. I'll pause it while I close this up and clear the energy and reset. All right, family. I'm back. We're going to reset and clear this energy so I can get you some guardian angel messages and messages from heaven. Most high God, we thank you. Divine angels, ancestors, spirit guides, archangels, we thank you for your love and protection. Thank you for blocking out anything that's been sent our way that is not of the highest white light. Archangel Michael, Archangel Uriel, Archangel Gabriel, Archangel Metatron. Archangel Sandoval, thank you for being here. What messages do you have for my loved one? What should they be aware of? This was never going to hit you. The divine loves you. They love them too. And they're, they're covering you right now. They're surrounding you right now. They're going to comfort you and help you get through whatever this is. For whoever this is for. This message is not going to be for everyone. This is someone specific I feel. That has had somebody very close to you that you would have never expected in a million years to do this. Okay? Somebody that you would give anything for. You may even give your life for this person. Okay? This is going to be a process. The healing process. This is why the divine is coming out. Okay? The divine father coming out right now. Helping you. They're going to help you. Regain your stability, your power, because this is going to hit. I'm not going to lie to you. This is going to hurt you. I'm feeling the pain. This is why I was crying so hard. Okay? But you're okay. You're going to be okay. You're going to make it through this. Okay? This card says, The Divine Father, thank you for co-creating my world with me, giving inner power, okay? Helping you to stay strong. 
okay we have trust your vibes thank you angels today i choose to trust my intuition and your guidance okay they want you to stay connected so that they can give you the downloads and the insight and help you to continue to heal and show you how to move they want you to stay connected express your creativity thank you angels for help me helping me to express my inner creator okay so this is the energy of how to channel the pain how to deal with sadness frustration what you're going through they want you to express yourself creatively okay allow this to help you create something beautiful from it i'm seeing somebody painting so you may be guided to paint this is you be honest with yourself and express your creativity they want you to allow yourself to feel this is not going to be an easy thing i have to be honest they want you to be honest with yourself about your feelings about your emotions allow those things to be released to come to the to the surface so that you can really truly see it and heal it this card is a number five that talks about change okay and it's going to be gradual it says all your feelings even the difficult ones have a message for you accept your truth then let source take it from there okay Archangel Mary, open your heart with compassion and fold others in love. This situation has the potential to make you close off your heart because this is someone you opened your heart with without any reservation or restrictions, without any limitations. So this situation will naturally make you want to close off your heart in due time, okay? You're going to be able to open your heart the way that you did before okay and that's why they want you to stay connected and there's ironically a heart here okay so that you can use your discernment this is not something don't beat yourself up this is not something you would have ever known or seen coming okay i'm feeling somebody feeling like how did not see this why didn't i know this and getting into that energy and the divine is saying no this is not this person was in sheep's clothing. This person hid themselves very well, okay? Archangel Samael, choose harmonious responses, act with wisdom and grace. This is given the energy of anger. Somebody here, this will make you angry. You're going to go through levels of emotions of pain and anguish, frustration, Sadness. There's going to be a lot of emotions attached to this situation. So that's why they're advising you to, to be honest with yourself. Allow those emotions, excuse me guys. Allow those emotions to <clears throat> come to the surface so that you can do something creatively to release what you're feeling. And so that it doesn't come out in anger. Okay chakra balancing is very important there's so much blue here that i can see this is throat chakra energy this is make this is going to make you want to go off if this person is still around which i feel like this person may still be around at this time but i see they've already showed what's going to happen with this person and again i'm not prophesying anybody's endings or anything like that this is just what came out but there's this person you're going to want to go off you're going to want to let loose there's so much blue out here and green heart chakra and throat chakra the pain that this person imposed on your heart is going to make you want to go off on them throat chakra energy this energy of fire anger okay sacral chakra energy drive what you want to do to go forward passion anger okay 
So you're being guided to balance your chakras to make sure that you are acting with wisdom and grace, okay? And I know that this is not easy. It's hard for me to even tell you this right now because the magnitude of what I felt in that moment when God allowed me to sit in your energy and theirs, okay? Both of y'all is are crying, okay? This person is crying now. You could be as well. But this is this is heavy, okay? Let's see what the ancestors want to say. <clears throat> Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, Divine Ancestors. What messages do you have for our loved one? guiding you okay i'm hearing that clearly divine flow okay find a way to bring harmony back into your life take the first step okay they're lighting this path you see these lights going up the stairs they're guiding you root chakra energy they want you to get grounded with the red here baby steps one step at a time this 42 breaks down to a six which talks about balance harmony okay this talks about harmonious responses okay one day at a time one step at a time okay nature okay this is definitely going to help you to get grounded root chakra with the red and out in nature getting grounded Connecting in nature. Stand up for what you know is right. We are supporting you. This means setting strong boundaries. This does not mean you can't speak up for yourself. But they want you to just set boundaries. Because this situation has the potential to create a fire. Okay? This is giving me fire energy, okay? And we did see a lot about fire. There's something significant about fire signs. Earth, all signs, really. The water, the energy, the purging, the emotions. It's all water signs. The grounding, earth signs, okay? The mental conflict, the mind, swords, air signs, all signs. This could be for all signs, Okay? But getting out in nature and grounding yourself, they're going to be connecting with you and helping you. Okay, let's get a couple more, please. Divine, you are a star. Step into the spotlight where you belong. Number four. Okay, you are being protected. This is that I feel like they're showing you this. They do want you to know that you are the star. Okay, and you're going to be stepping into the spotlight doing what it is that you need to do okay we started this read with one two two about your spiritual path your goals what you're doing where your guides are leading you to okay this abundance energy there's something coming for you okay big okay this is water energy okay so cleansing your energy visiting a body of water staying hydrated okay they're showing me somebody that's getting some news and they're just stuck they're not eating they're not sleeping they're not drinking they're not doing anything they're stuck so they they show me the water like to make sure you're hydrating yourself <clears throat> make sure you are uh keeping your energy clear cleansed so that you can get the downloads that they're sending you okay this is the last one. Make room for that happy ending. It is now within your grasp, okay? So there's some blessings coming out of this situation. It's not going to be easy. I cannot sit here and lie to you. It's not. This is not a pretty situation at all, okay? But God is leading you. There is this horizon is coming up, okay? You're going to be okay. You know that, okay? Let's get a few guardian angel messages and then we'll close this out. I feel very drained, y'all. 
very just heavy just I gotta get out and get uh, get into the spiritual uh, cocoon okay to get my energy right I feel like this is gonna be the last one for today yeah this make room for the happy ending this manifestation and blessings are coming for you holy spirit holy angels what do you want our loved one to know We have courage. Dare to be different, to make mistakes. Create, for it's in creation that you exist. In this world of dreams that stem from the eternal heart, you are one with all of creation. All is possible. Go forth and be true to yourself, okay? For it is only through being true that you can be true to others. Wow. Positive change. Dare to be different. When you're criticized, remember that you'll never please everyone. Many brilliant, gifted individuals were not fully appreciated or understood in their own lifetime. Yet it is often they who have sown the seeds of change. So whatever you're doing, know that you are affecting positive change in the world. Know that you are heavily loved and supported and divinely guided. Give yourself grace, patience, one day at a time. The healing journey is ever evolving, okay? This is something that you're going to be doing for life, okay? God is always going to allow situations to play out, okay? so that we learn from them sometimes when people don't listen and don't follow the divine guidance this person had divine guidance as well a lot of it and they ignored it and they have to now live in that truth okay so just know i want they're saying get one more what is it holy spirit This is so emotional. I'm so sorry, y'all. Your angels are all around you, okay? Your angels are all around you. You are so loved. I love you so much, whoever you are. You're going to get through this, okay? You're going to have a testimony. It's going to be okay. Your angels are with you. I mean, close to you right now. <sighs> Guardian angel. Trust. All unfolds in perfect timing. You are one with divine will. Focus only on love. And all you truly desire will manifest at the most perfect moment. Be patient. I, your guardian angel, am watching over you. Okay. I love you, family. I really hope that this message helps you. Y'all already know your girl is a super sensitive, <laughs> hypersensitive <laughs> empath, which means when necessary, <laughs> God sits me in the energy to relay the message, okay, so that I can express to you properly what's going on. And this is one that's really heavy. This is probably one of the heaviest messages I've ever had. And God is just wanting you to know you're going to be all right, okay? 
okay? Your angels, they wouldn't even let me finish this read. I was not intended to get that out. They specifically said split it. <laughs> Y'all saw me feel it, and it's like, no, not that one. And I went right to it, and it's your guardian angel, okay? So please know that they are with you. They are hugging you right now. They're coming close. They're going to be with you every step of the way through this process, however this is going to pan out, okay? This is, I heard for more than just one person, okay? Um, but don't force this one on you. Please don't. If this is not your story, do not proclaim it, okay? Because this energy here, you don't want to volunteer to sit in this. Trust me, okay? I love you so much, family. Um... Check the light works goodie bag. If this is resonating with you, you are most likely sitting in the same energy I'm in right now. You're feeling something. You're sensing something. Your guides have nudged you about something. Please check the light works goodie bag. Um, specifically, Archangel Raphael wants to help you. Wants to work with you. What am I being guided again, Holy Spirit? Okay, they're guiding me here for some reason. Archangel Raphael is here. What's the message, Archangel Raphael? Archangel Raphael, what do you want to say? the message okay Archangel Raphael is saying no Something that somebody is thinking of doing, okay? Archangel Raphael is saying, don't do it. Don't do it, whatever this is. And what I'm trying to tell you, this anger, is something about anger. saying the answer will find you okay whatever this is you want to do don't do it do not do it okay this is a strong message okay this message been over but they keep not letting me end it because the archangels and angels want to make sure I get the message across to you Is there anything else here? Detox your friendships, okay? They're wanting you to, to separate yourself from certain people at this time. They're saying you know who you need to detox, who you need to get rid of in your energy, in your circle. Okay? Release resentment. Okay, anything else? Okay, no. All right, y'all. I love you so very much. I got to go get myself together, y'all. So, please, if this is resonating with you, and I, I, I will pray that it doesn't resonate with anybody. This is how heavy this energy is. I don't want to, I don't want this to be for anybody here. Not this negative part. But if it's resonating with you, Please, you're being guided to look through the light work city bag and get a, some meditations for energy cleansing, for stress relief, and for specifically for Archangel Raphael healing, okay? Uh, 
They're really going to help you and continuously use them. Okay, but you use your discernment. If you decide to use them, it is your decision. Okay, I'm not forcing anything on anybody. I just want to help. Okay, the light works goodie bag is loaded with a lot of meditations and affirmations that I've just compiled just for us because I love all of you. I want us to stay grounded and keep our energy cleansed. And um, yeah, okay. If you are in need of a personal read or um, anything else, just check the description box, okay? I love you guys so much. God is with you. Your guardian angel is with you. Peace and blessings. I shame.